with Tranquil C. Malbay Manus in third as they jump the last. Not a lot to choose between the three with Park That. Trying to come on the outside, racing inside the final 150. Tranquil C on the rail from Firebrand. Park That coming on well in third, but Tranquil C pulling out all the stops for Sean Flanagan. Going to win the opener for Paul Nolan. Second was Firebrand. With Tranquil C. Malbay Manus in third as they jump the last. Not a lot to choose between the three with Park That. Trying to come on the outside, racing inside the final 150. Tranquil C on the rail from Firebrand. Park That coming on well in third, but Tranquil C pulling out all the stops for Sean Flanagan. Going to win the opener for Paul Nolan. Second was Firebrand. Third Park That. Four Malbay Madness. And five was Tyson. Out in front, in splendid isolation, Sir Gerhard jumps it well as he has jumped throughout. Sempo has moved through to finish, uh, to go second ahead of Colby, Lyrian and Varnago, but racing up towards the finish. It's Sir Gerhard back to winning ways, having failed to stay the trip in the stairs hurdle last time. Back to winning ways here, back over two miles. Out in front, in splendid isolation, Sir Gerhard jumps it well as he has jumped throughout. Sempo has moved through to finish, uh, to go second ahead of Colby, Lyrian and Varnago, but racing up towards the finish. It's Sir Gerhard back to winning ways, having failed to stay the trip in the stairs hurdle last time. Back to winning ways here, back over two miles. So Gerhard, an easy winner. Second, Sempo runs a highly credible run after such a long, long absence. Call me Lyrian is third. Capo Corriello on the far side, over the last. And it was Leperand who landed in the lead. From Smiling Best, trying to renew its effort in second. Capo Corriello on the rail. But it's Leperand who's gone on and stayed on strongly up the line to win this. Finishing fast again, cast a spell, but Capo Corriello on the far side. Over the last, and it was Leperand who landed in the lead from Smiling Best, trying to renew its effort in second. Capo Corriello on the rail, but it's Leperand who's gone on and stayed on strongly up the line to win this. Finishing fast again, cast a spell, but the winner is Leperand, close for second, Capo Corriello, and the fast finishing once more, cast a spell, fourth with Smiling Best. Summer tide. Jumps it well, now is the hour half a length down in second. They've gone on from Fortune to Fortunata, but racing inside the final 150 yards. And Philip Burns just asks, now is the hour to extend and go on by a couple of lengths. And is going to win this pretty impressively up to the line. Now is the hour, Summer Tide the winner by about a length and a half from now is the hour in second. Summer Tide jumps it well, now is the hour half a length down in second. They've gone on from Fortune to Fortunata, but racing inside the final 150 yards. And Philip Burns just asks, now is the hour to extend and go on by a couple of lengths. And is going to win this pretty impressively up to the line. Now is the hour. Summer tied the winner by about a length and a half from now is the hour in second. Clear of fortune to fortune out of third. Sea Road Phil stayed on before ahead of Cosmic Blizzard, Mr. Wilson, and an epic song. A steer for launch. Again, he runs down that fence, and that was the that was the more uh, pronounced of the three in the straight, but he's uh, going to win this handily as they race up towards the finish. A steering for launch is going to win by about 12 to 15 lengths the match for the Bar 1 Racing Steeplechase. A steering for launch, the winner. A steering for launch, again, he runs down that fence and that was the, that was the more uh, pronounced of the three in the straight, but he's uh, going to win this handily as they race up towards the finish. A steering for launch is going to win by about 12 to 15 lengths the match for the Bar 1 Racing Steeplechase. A steering for launch, the winner. Lucid Dreams in second, probably about 20 lengths in it at the, at the death. But Lucky Zebo has the advantage as they jump the last. Lucky Zebo lands a length and a half in front of Chosen Witness to Capo Glory. Shadow Rider staying on the outside with Annie Road. But Lucky Zebo has a couple of lengths and racing up towards the line. Lucky Zebo going to land this for Henry de Bromet and Michael Connor. Shadow Rider comes through to be second, close to third. But Lucky Zebo has the advantage as they jump the last. Lucky Zebo lands a length and a half in front of Chosen Witness to Capo Glory. Shadow Rider staying on the outside with Annie Road. But Lucky Zebo has a couple of lengths and racing up towards the line. Lucky Zebo going to land this for Henry de Bromet and Michael Connor. Shadow Rider comes through to be second, close to third, and he rode in chosen witness ahead of Catch the Beast and Ashdale Bomb. He's home again with the advantage over Rochestown in the inner over the last. He's home again, lands with a fractional advantage over Rochestown on the rail. Heading inside the final 150 yards, he's home again. Rochestown rallying on the inside, but he's home again. Looks to have its measure as they come up towards the line. He's home again, going to win this for Eddie Colley, and ridden by Philip Burns, he's home again with the advantage over Rochestown in the inner over the last. He's home again, lands with a fractional advantage over Rochestown on the rail. Heading inside the final 150 yards, he's home again. Rochestown rallying on the inside, but he's home again. Looks to have its measure as they come up towards the line. He's home again, going to win this for Eddie Colley. And ridden by 
Philip Byrne second is Rochestown a gallon second they pull clear of lovely reaction in third Duffy's getaway four Get a motive giving chase in second. Looks to be vain chase at this stage, but now what do you think? Is out in front by three to four lengths. Get a motive is game in second. But now what do you think? Has three lengths of an advantage, is gonna hold it up to the line and up to the line. Now what do you think wins it from in second place? Get a motive giving chase in second. Looks to be vain chase at this stage, but now what do you think? Is out in front by three to four lengths. Get a motive is game in second. But now what do you think? Has three lengths of an advantage, is gonna hold it up to the line and up to the line. Now what do you think wins it from in second place is get a motive. They were clear of Churchill Prince in third, four behind those with She's a Night Owl followed in in fifth.